Hey guys, this is going to be a review for the iPhone 4 or 4S lens. Now this is the 3-in-1 photo lens. Um, you can also take video with it, but um, this is the box. Um, the front of it just tells you what kind of lenses comes with it. This is the lens in the middle. Um, on the side, just uh, tells a little bit more about it. Tells which phones, only iPhone 4 and iPhone 4S. Um, and then it just shows some pictures of how it takes. Really cool. And it just shows uh, what comes in the box exactly. Um, on the other side, same thing as the other side. Alright, so uh, let's get into it. This box came in good condition. Now, um, I ordered it from Amazon. Now, I ripped the box and sort of dented it up uh, when I was getting it out because this thing comes out and this ripped right here. So, it is not the people that sold me. It is me. Alright, so what you do is you just open up the box like normal, anything else. And it's a bit difficult because of this, and I sort of ripped it. Alright, so there's nothing else in the box. So it comes in this, and it opens by itself. So be careful. It comes with a nice uh, little, like, bag or whatever. You can put it in, and it uh, tightens up. And it's like a cleaning cloth type of thing. So uh, when you put it in there, it's going to be all clean when it comes out. So that, that's that. And I'll just put that to the side right there. And then there's nothing else right here. Alright, so here's the lens. Let me zoom in. Um, so, it has uh, the covers on right now, but very nice. Um, I'm actually going to unplug my Beats right now, just so it doesn't get in the way. Um, now, I ordered a few cases for my iPhone 4. So, um, here's one of them. I got one of them. It's, this one's just a gold case, and then on the back, it's like that. Uh, if you want me to do a review for this or any of the other cases that I'm getting, uh, go ahead and leave that in the comments. Um, so as you can see, this is a white iPhone 4. Alright, so uh, let me get up my um, camera so I can go ahead and show you a little bit. Okay. Uh, so, like normal, just looks like this. I mean, normal. And then when you take it off, um, very nice. Now, um, this is a bad thing, but you know, I don't think it's going to happen and it's not really that bad. Now, you see that white thing right there? That is a chip in the glass, and um, it's not that deep, but it's still there. And um, you know what? Let me zoom in and try to focus. Come on. Why is it not focusing? There we go. Okay, so uh, try to get it reflected. It's right there. Um, it's like not bad. But it's still, I don't know, it kind of bothers me. But nothing I can do. I mean, I could take it back, but then i got to pay for the shipping and stuff. And then the other side, like this, and then you unscrew it. The other one doesn't unscrew. And it's a macro lens. Okay, um, so that's pretty cool. I'm going to go ahead and uh, screw it back on. Okay. So... It only goes over the back, um, one, it can't go over the middle, so when it goes over, you just slide it right on, and then it makes it fish eye lens, and, uh, as you can see when I take it off, it gets, like, really close up, and it sort of zooms it out and just shows you a lot more, and then, um, so I really like this one, I took a few pictures, um, now when I take it off and then turn it around, it's like a fish eye, but it's wide angle. It's not as much, not as extreme. So this one doesn't look as warpy. So I guess you could take pictures like, and it wouldn't look that like bad. But I mean, it the other one doesn't look bad. It just it's a bit extreme, and that's kind of cool how it has the little corners showing. All right. So now when um I take off this to make it macro lens. Um, everything is extremely blurry until you get up close and it shows very fine detail um, and it's really nice I mean it does show you detail on anything it's very cool um, so I think my favorite lens on this one is this one I don't know why I just think it looks cool took a few pictures with it so uh, yeah very nice 
I would recommend getting this one or this lens out of all the other lenses. I just think it's better. If you get one of the lenses where you have to like put a sticky thing on the back and then it magnetically goes on. I didn't like that one because then you couldn't use other cases. It would just uh, or you would have to take out the sticky thing and not be able to use it. So this just slides right on. Looks very nice. Um, you can store it easily in the um, little bag it comes with. And these uh, little things right here are like made out of rubberish plastic. So it won't be scratching your lens or whatever. And then when you put it in here, you can actually put it in here without the lens on. Or the lens caps on. And it stays nice and safe in here. This is what I do to put it in my pocket. Um, so let me get this box. And the plastic thing really doesn't matter. Alright, so yeah, this is my review for the um, three in one shot or one photo lens. That's what it says on the box. I didn't know the name until now. But yeah, go ahead and search that. And it did come in red, and I just got black. I don't know why. Um, but red is cool, and I would recommend getting red or black. Your choice. Um, so yeah, uh, I'll go over there and uh, say a little bit more about it. Um, very nice lens. I just, I don't know, I would just really recommend getting these if you like taking pictures. Well, uh, I just recorded two minutes of without the microphone on, so it had no, it had no sound. So, uh, trying it again. Uh, don't really remember what I went over, but um, like I was saying, uh, if you were going to get a lens that make your uh, camera and picture like really cool, and video, that's what I'm going to be using mine for. And this is very like compact and small, and there's three lenses in one. Three lens in one. Um, I would get that one. There, this one is like the best for like the wide angle and uh, stuff like that. But there's no zoom. Well, there's a zoom lens, which I might be getting next um, because I think the zoom lenses are really cool. Um, but this is the one I got for right now, and I have four or five other cases coming in not including this one so if you uh, want to review on any of these go ahead and leave it in the comments and I will review that and uh, there's really nothing upcoming that I can talk about that I usually talk about over here um, so I think that's about it um, I'll see you guys next time